Hello, my name is Ian Tyler. Welcome to my portfolio demonstration video. Trucker Tracker is a web-based inventory and invoicing software created by Clinton Booz, Blake Sutton, John Daniels, and myself. It's primarily created in PHP using HTML and CSS for formatting, although AJAX and JavaScript were utilized in database interaction protocols. Its purpose is to provide a simple-to-use interface for tracking of shipments and inventory and earnings that also scales on mobile devices to be available anywhere. To provide a clean, unified look, it utilizes Twitter Bootstrap, and it also features account control with administrator roles while protecting information on the MySQL database using Blowfish encryption. As you can see, Trucker Tracker offers a rich amount of options while keeping the interface very simple to interact with, making it easier to use on a mobile device when shrunk down to smaller sizes. This allows an individual to track all necessary parts of shipments, invoicing, and even maintenance on each individual vehicle. Ian's word processor is a lightweight word processor created in C++. It features standard file menu functions such as copy, paste, and file open and save features. It saves files as rich text, allowing them to maintain formatting integrity without making them an exclusive file type, such as a Microsoft.docs file. It also allows the user to change the text size, font, and color. I actually created this at a time when I did not have Microsoft Office, so it helped to fulfill a genuine need that I had. It essentially fulfills the basic needs of a text editor, such as Notepad, but allows better formatting functions to allow for better notes. So it could be used especially in a situation such as a student needing to take notes and highlight certain sections or change sections to different font to stick out, etc. Hot Wawa MP3 Player was a collaborative effort between Clinton Booz, Jonathan Gill, Lederic Payne, and myself. It was created to meet a client's needs who requested a lightweight, simple MP3 player. It was built in Java to allow cross-platform capabilities. Our program features a simple interface with toggleable options to add or remove features from the interface. Here's a demonstration of a song playing using the Hot Wawa program. Here's using the seek bar to skip ahead. And here's what the playlist looks like. You can click this button to add a song to generate a personalized playlist. You can double click a song to play a new song. Or you can skip ahead using the next button. We have a volume control option 
which allows the user to bring the volume up or down as demonstrated, as well as the ability to export a playlist for later import and playing. So now I'm going to demonstrate importing a playlist that we just created. This will allow us to save the way we wanted to listen to our music. A playlist is a must for any MP3 player, no matter how simple. So we select our playlist, Hialtaline. We're going to open our playlist, although we could just hit play. And there it is. We'll double click the song to resume listening. Here's the log file, which shows which songs have played and all of the relevant metadata. PyProtect Home Security was created to meet the demand for low-cost, low-maintenance home security system without compromising on features. It was built in Python and configured and run on a Linux-based Raspberry Pi system. The system revolutionizes home security, costing approximately $100 to build, with a minimal annual electricity usage of approximately $3. The system features passive infrared motion detection, a radio frequency identification module, camera and video with included audio, and automated email alerting. I'm very passionate about this product and have spent a large amount of time looking for low-cost, high-security options to no avail. Best of all, it's licensed under open source MIT license and is publicly available with extensive documentation. I'm going to demonstrate here the example email alert that includes 15 seconds of video to help you identify who the intruder is. Now this system automatically sends these emails immediately upon completing the video so you are aware of anyone in your home at any time. And it also logs all events in the system, such as when the system's armed or disarmed, as well as when it's disarmed and by whom. It includes a photo that was originally set to be three photos in rapid succession. However, I reduced it to one just for the sake of quicker demonstration. Thank you for taking the time to watch my presentation. Feel free to look at the other materials on my website.